Video editing can be a long and sometimes painful process. Tens or even hundreds of raw clips needing to be sorted through, organized and put together into a video, sometimes as short as only a few minutes. And I remember a few years ago when I was just getting started with video editing, I would spend hours working on a video, but for some reason it just never ended up looking the way I wanted it to. Back then I had no idea why this was the case. However, now looking back at the videos that I made back then, I now completely understand why. And the reason was that I was making a few detrimental video editing mistakes that were ruining my videos completely. So in this video, I'm going to reveal those mistakes to you so you can avoid wasting your time by not making them at all. And by the way, the last one is definitely the most important. Reason number one, I kept using unprofessional looking effects. When I started video editing, I believed that adding loads of effects would make my videos look more professional and impressive. However, back then I wasn't actually good at using the effects that I wanted to use. So the effects that I would add would just look like shit and they would make my videos just look like cringe 2012 Call of Duty montages, which was definitely not the look I was going for. So a quick bit of advice I would give to anyone wanting to level up their video editing is to try to use more professional effects. For example, instead of using a really obvious glitch, maybe just use a simple glitch instead. Because when it comes to video editing, bigger isn't always better. And most of the time, just using simple effects will make your videos look a lot more professional. The second reason was that I was neglecting sound design completely. You know when you watch a film or a YouTube video or any type of visual media, you consume the video in two ways. The first one is by watching it, obviously, but most of the time, unless you're in class where you're not meant to be watching a video, or you're on a train where you want to be quiet and you don't want people to hear what you're watching, you'll also hear the video. And to be completely honest with you, it took me a while before I even realized this. And before I did, I was basically just making videos only thinking about how the video would look. Now I realize that the visuals are only 50% of the viewing experience that the audience or viewer goes through. So when you neglect sound or sound design, you're basically neglecting 50% of the video. And also, when you don't really think about sound when you're editing a video, your videos will always have something missing because a massive part of storytelling is sound. And I can prove this right now. What I'm about to show you is the start of a short film that I made a while ago. For my whole life, I've always loved cars. Even from the age of five, I would watch car films with my dad and sometimes, on the weekend, he would take me to the supercar rallies, which I loved even more than Christmas. And now watch it with no sound. You see, when you take away the sound, the overall viewing experience goes down a lot. So definitely don't neglect sound design. The last reason why my video editing was bad was because I didn't color grade properly or at all. Most people when they get into filmmaking or video editing don't think about color grading at all. I definitely didn't for a while. However, color grading is the easiest way to take your videos or films to the next level. And this can literally happen overnight. I learned the basics of how to color grade in only a couple hours. And also all major films that you see in the cinema have been color graded so much. And if you took the color grading away from a film and you then showed the same film in the cinema again, no one would even like it. And this is because the film would just have this sort of bland look to it. So if you want to learn to color grade fast, I made a video walking you through how I personally color grade in a really fast and effective way. And you can watch that video here.